for pain. You can't describe the language. We create stories, language of agency. It's a verbal strategy. It's an internalization strategy. It has a positive that allows you to keep your sense of self and be stable in the pain. But the negative aspect of number three is it pushes your pain more invisible, not just to other people, but to you. Because the pain's in your shadow, you're terrified of getting triggered, but your language of agency hid the pain into your shadow. You actively put the pain into your unconscious, put it for future, put it on the shelf. You did it by the language of agency. This person did it with intention. I did it with intention. I got to fix it this way. You created a story narrative that everyone was conscious. How number one and number two are false. You created a story. I'm better than human. The narcissist is better than human. So you create a story to personalize it and make it really dramatic and exciting. Puts it in your shadow or dumps it on somebody else. But then you're in constant fear of the future of getting triggered again. That's the downside. So Plus then you lose yourself? Yeah, then you have no self because all you're doing is keeping this in play, this story of agency, which is your old zombie self that wants to die. And you're constantly resuscitating it and finding new narcissists to keep that old pattern continuing. You don't want that to die.